हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू गिव यू टेन लेटेस्ट डिफेंस अपडेट्स नंबर वन सिक्स मोर नेत्रा एम के वन ए नेक्स्ट ईयर द इंडियन एयरफोर्स प्लान्स टू मेक अ स्ट्रेंज केस फॉर द इंडक्शन ऑफ सिक्स मोर नेत्रा एम के वन ए एयरबॉर्न अर्ली वार्निंग एंड कंट्रोल सिस्टम एयरक्राफ्ट इन द अपकमिंग ईयर दिस अपग्रेडेड वेरियंट विल कॉम्प्लीमेंट the three existing netra mk1 a aircraft that are already operational with the iaf next uh, armed archer ng male class uav faces scrutiny the aeronautical development establishment proposed development of the armed archer ng male class uav has been met with increased scrutiny from the indian armed forces the armed forces have set uh, stringent benchmarks for the uav demanding that it achieves an operational uh, altitude of over 30000 feet and endurance of 18 hours or more and the capacity to carry a payload of 300 kg including weapons next delivery of 26 dhanush howitzer advanced weapons and equipment india is poised to significantly bolster the indian army's artillery capabilities by delivering 26 new dhanush howitzers during the current financial year this delivery will bring the total number of dhanush guns in service to 50 making a major step towards fulfilling the army's order of 114 guns in total next aditya l wants sweet capture full disk images of the sun in near ultraviolet wavelengths the solar ultraviolet imaging telescope that is sweet s u i t instrument on board the aditya l1 spacecraft has successfully captured the first full disk images of the sun in the 200 to 400 nm wavelength range sweet captures images of the sun's photosphere and chromosphere in the in this wavelength range using various scientific filters next super hercules carries out precision air drop of combat troops The Indian Air Force C130J Super Hercules aircraft has carried out a precision air drop of combat troops as well as specialized war fighting equipment in the north eastern sector during the Indo-US joint military exercise Vajra Prahar. Next Suit to stop Netherlands exporting F-35 parts to Israel. Human rights groups sought to block the Dutch government from exporting F-35 fighter jet parts to Israel, arguing in court on Monday that the exports could make the Netherlands complicit in possible war crimes. Next, organizing tabletop exercise for women officers. from asean s a s e a n the indian army has conducted a table top exercise for women officers from a s e a n countries with an aim to promote gender inclusivity and enhance capabilities of women military personnel in peacekeeping operations the exercise is a part of ongoing efforts of the center for united nations peacekeeper peace keeping to strengthen international cooperation and capacity building in keep peace keeping missions with specific focus on empowering women next mgs shows promise against global competition the vehicle research and development establishment based in ahmedabad ahmednagar india has undertaken a project named mounted gun system that is mgs this project aims to develop a state of the art artillery system 
for the Indian Armed Forces. The VRDE MGS has been compared to other contemporary MGS system currently in operation around the world. Next, nations seek alternatives to Russian weapons. Indian Astra MK1, a beyond visual range air to air missile that is BV RAM, is gaining traction among nations that operate Russian Sukhoi Su-30 variants, signaling a growing interest in Indian developed defense technologies. This surge in interest comes following significant orders from the Indian Air Force, one of the world's largest operators of the Su-30 family of aircraft. Next, thermal images for enhanced surveillance capabilities. The Indian Army is in the process of acquiring 10,000 handheld thermal imager uncooled devices according to a request for information uploaded on its official website. The HHTIUC is a surveillance device that will enable soldiers to carry out surveillance up to 3,000 meters in both day and night conditions. It will be equipped with a high resolution optical viewer digital that is low light and thermal uncooled sensors and a largest and a laser range finder for judging distances. The device will also provide soldiers with their own location using an inbuilt satellite navigation system including NAVIC. Thank you.